see if I can get some famous people. Hey, how are you? Famous? I'm not famous, not no. Famous, no. no. It's okay. I don't even know who these people are. How are you? Hey, not too bad. I've got my YouTube channel. I do YouTube. Do you? Yeah. 50,000 subscribers. That's crazy. Thank you. Hi guys, Archie Luxury, Archie Luxury Channel. And I want to say today, I want to talk about tennis, Tennis Australia. And uh, if any of the viewers out there are tennis players, uh, you would have seen the recent disaster, the recent disaster that's flared up with some of the, the two top players. Uh, it, it's quite fascinating and uh, what I wanted to uh, throw into this argument is is that Rolex dealers are behaving exactly the same that's right Rolex dealers and this is why Rolex I suspect sponsors the tennis because they also Rolex dealers behave like a bunch of fucking cunts that's right this is the way Rolex dealers behave there, and uh, it's it's nothing new. What am I talking about? I'm talking about the lawsuits and all the innuendos and accusations being leveled against the two players, Bernard Tomic, who's the father. Uh, we've got uh, so there's Tomic, and we've got sorry. Sorry, sorry, the father of Bernard Tomic, so Bernard Tomic's the player, I don't watch much sport, fuckers, says he will begin legal action against Leighton Hewitt as the rift between the tennis duo descends into a full-blown war. And he's got all these accusations. Leighton Hewitt's come out and said that Tomic had been threatening him and his family and threatened to blackmail him. Hey! That's exactly how the Rolex ADs behave if you tell them some home truths. Let's see if I can get some famous people. Hey, how are you? Famous? I'm not famous, not no. Famous. Oh, no, no. It's okay. I don't even know who these people are. How are you? Hey, not too bad. I've got my YouTube channel. I do YouTube. Do you? Yeah. 50,000 subscribers. That's crazy. Thank you. That's the way these fuckers behave. And Rolex ADs, you tell them there's a problem, they ask you to send them proof, it's like some screenshots, and then the cunts turn around and want to sue you. That's exactly right. They are miserable, slimy sons of fucking bitches. They accuse you of trying to blackmail and extort them. And the honest truth is the ADs, these ADs <clears throat> have been wanting, um, they've been wanting kickbacks. Kickbacks, that's right. To sell hard to get sports models, even the Tudor Pepsi, you've got to pay a kickback. Pay kickback. Otherwise, you will not get hard to get Rolex. And I gotta tell you, this is the whole thing. Tennis Australia 
has got a great sponsor in Rolex because Rolex dealers themselves, they behave like a bunch of fucking cunts. That's it. The Rolex ADs behave like a bunch of fucking cunts. I've got proof of multiple dealers in Australia. I've spoken to people's concerned uh, and they pay kickbacks. They pay kickbacks. That's exactly right. They pay kickbacks to get hard to get stock. And uh, it's not just one AD, there's quite a number of ADs. There's ADs who've got relationships with members of certain motorcycle bikey gangs. You've got some really fucking nasty stuff that is going on there. So, uh, Tennis Australia and Rolex, what a fantastic partnership! Because the ADs are behaving like cunts! Absolute fucking cunts! And if you go to an AD and say, look, I'm just a little bit concerned, I'm Joe Public, I'm just, I just love my Roli, I love my Rolex sports watches, and I just noticed that maybe someone who, one of your dealers is, uh, taking kickbacks, the dealer will say, sure, send me proof. Then the fucking AD turns around and says, we will sue you, we reserve the right to sue you for defamation and extortion. Fuck you, Rolex AD. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. That's all I can say. And as for Leighton Hewitt and uh, our other good friend there, Bernard Tomic, i got to be completely frank. Let me throw my two cents in there. I think, I think both these guys have got some equal blame, okay? Uh, Leighton Hewitt's had a massive fucking ego. Uh, and i got to be honest with you, uh, Bernard Tomek, he's been a bit of a jerk as well. I think the reality is both these guys here, massive tennis egos, massive, massive... <laughs> You know, just absolute wah-wah. They all come out crying wah-wah. Fuck you, you lousy tennis players. Get back to the fucking tennis game and stop fucking bitching. You fucking miserable cunts. That's what I can say. Let me say this to you. Leighton Hewitt and uh, Bernard Tomic, you were both miserable, nasty fucking cunts. Shut your fucking mouth and get back on the court and play tennis. We don't want to hear what comes out of your filthy, stinking fucking mouth. No, we don't. We want to see tennis. We don't want you two guys bitching, bitching, like a bunch of middle-aged divorced women at a fucking, at a fucking, fucking divorce conference. That's what it's like, you bunch of sissy girls. And I gotta tell you, it's so fucking pathetic. Fucking pathetic. Get your fucking ass back on the court and stop fucking whinging. And uh, I gotta tell you there, you know, I've known a few few uh, Yugoslavs in my time. They, they're, they're vicious fuckers, but they also can be pretty damn, you know, you can reason with them and be nice. Leighton Hewitt's just a cunt. Bernard Tomic, he's just another cunt. Just fucking settle your differences. Let the egos go down and move forward. Threatening legal action with each other. What a bunch of fucking sissies. It's no different to Rolex dealers threatening me with, <laughs> with all wild accusations. Don't you fucking worry, Rolex dealers. I'm going to fucking milk that letter you lousy cunt sent me for every fucking bit of YouTube gold footage I can. Fuck you, fuck you. And if you were the silly woman who wrote the fucking letter, fuck me dead. I'm going to capitalize it to the absolute best way I can, sweetie. So fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. This is Archie Luxury reporting on Tennis Australia and Rolex's sponsorship. Rolex, you got it 100% right. Your dealers are cunts. All the sportsmen at Tennis Australia are cunts. What a fucking wonderful sp sponsorship. They're just fucking cunts. So uh, well done to Rolex for picking the right sport. 
Bunch of cunts. Your dealers are cunts. They're all fucking cunts. Archie Luxury, reporting the truth. I got some footage. I met some famous players in Melbourne last week at the Australian Open. Take a look. Fucker Roonies! Where are we going now, Dave? All the shops, sir. Are the, the Rolex dealers or they're all closed now? They don't have Friday night late night city. It is very bullshit. Ah, uh, I don't know. Hard to say. Oh, that's for the tennis. It's for the tennis. It's a tennis guy. I don't even know who the hell it is. Are they?
Let's see if I can get some famous people. Hey, how are you? Famous? I'm not famous, no. Not famous. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. I don't even know who these people are. How are you? Hey, not too bad. I've got my YouTube channel. I do YouTube. Do you? Yeah. 50,000 subscribers. That's crazy. Thank you.